1st, 1960. Clutch Nixon, at that time a little-known stuntman of the Holland Valley, spontaneously combusted while performing a stunt now known as the Baptism of Fire. Hurtling at speeds never attempted by mortal men, Clutch's body most likely ignited due to a blood alcohol level of 0.67. Despite man and machine being fused together by the heat of a thousand suns, Clutch managed to survive by maneuvering his vehicle into a nearby stream. Witnesses to the feat assumed he had perished, but Clutch Nixon emerged from the water like a phoenix rising from the ashes, and a legend was born. To this day, it remains a feat never once repeated. through a pristine river valley, firing heavy artillery attached to a civilian aircraft. Although he never crashed, Clutch nevertheless suffered an injury to his brow ridge that left him unable to see color. That same year, Clutch accidentally sparked a race riot at the launch party of his first volume of erotic poetry. Ironically, both the stunt and the book are named Old Glory Holes, and neither have been surpassed since that day. the old 
full gold dredge now. They nearly touched that bridge. What incredible marksmanship. An incredible stunt. They've survived. bachelor party that lasted three weeks. During the festivities, George made a bet that Clutch couldn't fly an airplane through a nearby ravine while simultaneously bullseyeing every obstacle in his path. Clutch Nixon replied, hold my beer. Even though Clutch was so drunk that to the day he died, he never regained full conscious control of his bladder. He still managed to complete the dare before that beer even went cold. And to this day, the spray and prey has never again been repeated by mortal man. Good grip 
on the wheel on those wooden ramps. They've got it made. That ATV could flip on the landing. sphincter-clenching thrill of human flight. But delight quickly turned to agony when a tree branch punctured his femoral artery on the way down. Fortunately, the blood loss made him more buoyant and aerodynamic, allowing him to become the Lord of the Wings, a stunt the likes of which has never been seen again. of clean living 
and having achieved financial success beyond his wildest dreams, Clutch Nixon leapt off the mountain and was never seen again. After months of searching, no body was ever found, and Clutch Nixon was declared legally dead. But every year, hundreds of his most loyal fans throw themselves off this very cliff as tribute to their long-lost hero. God speed, Clutch Nixon. You magnificent son of a bitch. God speed.